I saw a picture of this uh, singing artist, and all of a sudden my mind was playing their their song. And I said, really? The mind was playing their song? Their song was playing? You're like, yeah. I said, where's the guitar? And it took a little bit of back and forth. I said, is it the song you're hearing? And they were like, yeah, well, parts of it. No, is it the song, the actual song that you're hearing? Well, some of the words and lyrics, no. Is it the song? <laughs> you know the song in reality when you hear a song? Is that what you're hearing? And then they're, oh. oh. What was I getting at? You weren't hearing a song. You're hearing the mind. This is just like the fireman photo where I said, right? What's going on here? And everybody says, oh, there's a fire and there's two firemen and they're putting it out and there's water. And I'm like, well, if there's a fire, should we be worried? And if there's water, why isn't my computer wet? Right? That's not what it is. And they said, well, yeah, but, you know, nobody's going to say that's not a song. I said, that's the first step to unconsciousness, to talking about something as if it's real when it's not. That's the first step. It's so sneaky, hmm? so slippery. And almost everybody in society does this. What are we saying? We're saying, and then through the conversation with that person, they started to see. It's like, oh, is mind, is mind a poor replica or imitation of the reality? I said, yeah, very poor, right? Then, then he started to realize, Oh yeah, I can't hear the drums and the guitar and everything all at once. I can only hear the dr the drums. I can't hear the guitar at the same time. And this was a very good insight I hadn't even thought of before. But it's true. If you try to listen to a song in your head, you're not going to hear the full orchestra. You're not going to hear the full band. You're probably hearing the words and the melody. That's about it, right? And that's a tip-off. That's how we know that what we're hearing in the mind is not the reality. There is a stark difference between the reality and the mind. Otherwise, we'd be really confused. So we have to use that difference and use your power of discernment to get radical about it. To go, is that what, what they really said? Did they say that? Did I say that? Or did the mind not say that, but just make a sound, make a picture. <laughs>